Hello everyone. <clears throat> Just wanted to show you guys uh, Ubuntu Touch. I guess you guys have all seen you uh, videos of it and stuff. And now they have my Nexus 7. Basically, I can do whatever I want with it and try <clears throat> basically any ROM I want. So most people haven't known, but <clears throat> what hasn't been said is how this thing unlocks and just does a bunch of different stuff. So I just want to give a quick overview because you really don't know. Because like when, when you see people down when you see them look so confused. But yeah, when you bring this down, you can't bring it down here and expect it to work. Sorry, I'm not even like. All right, you can swipe. Yeah, you pull in from the left to go back to the app to the menu, just like hit just like hitting the super key, and it'll show you open apps. And to close them, which many people don't know, is you hold them, you hold it down. And that exit uh, icon comes up, and you can close the icons with that. But don't want to do that. Going back up here. Oh, sorry about that. And you don't drag it all the way. You got to keep it up top, because why would you? If you you want to view, and then now you want to change. So that's why you can't keep it down too far. Or it won't move. You see that? So it won't move. So you have a certain distance up there. Which is just a small view. Not going up. To, most of these things are just uh, placeholders. And still being coded uh you can subscribe to the mailing list and you'll get updates and just see what's going on with the development of ubuntu touch which i have too and what i what i wanted to do is get more people on board because at, originally i didn't know that uh that there was a how would you say it? for html5 stuff like that is doable but they didn't demo that they demoed the ui of this like if I can open up an app and sh show you guys, but uh, we could app to demo that. Basically, uh, yeah, the gallery, or shit, yeah, the gallery. They they demo this UI just the the stuff they created, the pull up uh, toolbars and all that stuff. All that stuff you basically see Google doing now. You want to touch it first. But I'm not going to get too much into that. You've got all these menus, which is really nice, and it's really smooth. And it's really easy to understand and develop with, uh, or even use <clears throat> on the computer. I'm watching uh, Attack of Titan right now. Where is it? Yeah, this QT, and you can deploy it. I haven't really done too much to understand it yet, but and that's that's different code. It's not even up yet. But, yeah, for the most part, it's pretty smooth. I mean... There, there's a few quirks with the, with touching and swiping that does need worked out. It's not really with the apps, but uh, and more so in the menu, and just more apps basically. I mean, this is pretty much the two things and the features that they said they would have. Because right now, like the music player and all that stuff are all, all that stuff's been done on the desktop, but not on the tablet. And rotations apparently not working on the demo. Or until the next version, and I believe this is raring, but yeah, there's no really too much information you can, for you to check on that, And but it's easy to flash and update, so I really can't complain about that. Uh, yeah, it is a pretty nice demo, but they still have a, a little bit way to go. More, more is just basically getting the stuff into the OS, because it is done. Well, I mean, it is done on concept on the desktop, just porting it to touch. So, but I really enjoy it, and uh, when the Ubuntu device gets announced, I am most definitely getting one. Thank you guys for watching, and Grandmaster out.